guys in toes. <laughs> color guys in toes. I don't get it. Colored and I Indian don't... guys with toes gets me, those. yo. Those. Those. I don't get it. Like, I love toes. If I'm chilling with a girl, I would just play with her feet for no reason. Instead of holding her hand, like, I would play for her. Are you serious? Yeah. I love feet. <sighs> and it sucks for me. So, like, do you judge a girl when you first meet her based on her feet? Are you, nah, like, one, are you like one of those? Like, I won't judge her, but it will, like, you know. Okay. I'll be like, hey, ah, just like, nice, but at home just like, sub, uh, just like subtract two points. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> For his birthday this year, I went to the grave and I collected a few women's toes, <laughs> and then I gave it to him in a bag. The gift. The good friend. That's, That's a very thoughtful gift. <laughs> Huh? The bones? I cut the whole toe off huh? with the bones. So you just gave your friend for his birthday a bag of rotting toes. <laughs> they, like they toes, and they all belong to women. So yeah. the did it make you counts. happy? That's Ooh, a very yeah. thoughtful <laughs> gift. <laughs> yeah. I mean, very creepy, but I mean, I love feet. I don't know. Why. I, I love feet. It's not even like I just love women's feet, not all feet. Speaking about feet, mm-hmm. you do beauty style. Skincare. Yeah. Those are your thing, three. Mainly black beauty and skincare. Yeah. What is that? What is beauty? Because I know a lot of chicks assume that they do or into beauty, but what does what what does beauty? Beauty is everything. Beauty? I mean, it's like it's self care. It's your it's your hair. It's your skin. It's your face. Your entire body. Your feet. Your feet. <laughs> yeah. 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 And how do you how are you in that industry? What is that industry? How does it? what makes it up so i'm um influencer but oh. mainly skincare and beauty and i just share my knowledge with my audience so people send you products yeah people send oh, me really? products i'll go to events yeah. with these dermatologists and That's just cool. learn more about this is a nice skin. life so you basically Yo. influence people into being beautiful yeah, yeah I'm like, this is so good for you. <laughs> <laughs> so on but, your, but I'm always very, very honest. Like, I don't post stuff if I don't believe in it. So on your platform, you say, hey, stop being ugly. Yeah. Use this. And be beautiful. Now. Yeah. You know, it's like if you want to be soft, you know, if you yeah. want like soft, soft feet. <laughs> 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 but it's like, uh, if you, like skin concerns, like if you have dry skin, I'm like, okay, okay cool. You don't, you have oily skin, use yeah. this. Yeah. You know, like, yeah. maybe like. Okay. But how does one? How did you get into this? Oh my gosh! I actually, have, I like felt that it was it was strange because during COVID, yeah. I was like, why haven't I been doing this? Because I grew up with my with a, my mom was always in the beauty industry, so I always had beauty products around me, and like you know, I grew up that way. So when I packed to go somewhere, I always have like my lotions and my potions in like a little section for clothes. Yeah. So I, like, I grew up it was always something I loved. And then during COVID, like things just happen, and like, I was like, "Yeah, let's just yeah. do it. Let's do let's, let's influence. Let's do it. Let's influence. These people let's lack influence. influence. <laughs> <Beauty>. <laughs> so that's like your what you do for a living. Yeah, just beauty, beauty Beauties. products, attend events, and this is a nice life. Man. Yeah, it is yeah. cool. And you get to like just have beautiful skin yeah. for free because they give you the stuff. No, but like I think people are. Complicate skincare. Yeah, keep it simple. I've Cleanse seen like moisturizer SPF. Yeah. Skincare is where they have like out, ten right. steps, and I'm, I could never. Yeah, I'm yeah. late all the time. Yeah. yeah, and Vaseline. Your clear yeah. skin. <laughs> yeah, I use what's available. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not putting a mask on. You know. <laughs> Whatever's there. And then sit with cucumba on your eyes. Are you like one of those five in one shampoo, face cleanser, yeah. body wash? <laughs> that pisses me yeah. off so also, much. Because you guys have such uh, good skin. It also kill it also kills the sins inside of you. Because <laughs> <laughs> like that lotion does everything. Oh my god. <laughs> Purpose. Guys, yeah. you will literally like wipe your face with a dirty hand towel and still have good skin. Yeah. It's annoying. It and is. And then you just there doing your thing like your ten yeah. skincare routine. You're just like, oh. Yeah, it's like one know, day in the month things, where my skin looks good, and that's things, it. Women make a fuss about like guys don't even care what. You know, we don't care what your skin looks like. But it's because you guys you oh. haven't experienced it, you know. Yeah. yeah. 
Like, and you think you, you don't care, <laughs> but you do care. You, like, you do care. Once you start getting uh, introduced to the lotions and the serums, you're like, oh, this is nice. <laughs> Your face feels better. <laughs> I won't lie. The other day, I didn't sleep at all. And I used someone's... Um, they had like a, a face lotion. A face is wash. This from face. where you were sleeping? Yeah. So, they had a face yeah. wash. Yeah. And I used it. And then the whole day, I'm like, damn, why am I like, smelling like, so like, nice? Like, this is nice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm smelling delicious. Oh, this is good. I need to see somebody. Like, <laughs> someone needs to see me. But, uh, yeah, but other than that, it's not like the next day, I was like, yo, I need I to. I need this face yeah, wash. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Wow. It was like, it was nice for the day, but yeah. like, yeah. move, it, move yeah. along. Yeah. Where's, where's that Vaseline? <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen, Vaseline's good, eh? Like, <laughs> no, it's good. Yeah, that's wild. Beauty. I want to do beauty for a living. Me too. I mean, you got good skin. I think I think you should. Yeah. yeah. We should get Dakes into doing makeup. I must what? do makeup. What? Yeah. yeah, I want to. Just make beauty. He does the makeup. On work. himself. Like those YouTubers. Yeah, like James Charles. I want makeup on the podcast. Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Was the beautiful. 50th episode, yeah, no? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wow, but I don't think I can. It can like a regular practice. Yeah, it's a lot bath of work. Bathing already takes long. <laughs> like, bathing already takes long. Now I must still do my face. You know, and that takes. Yeah, yeah. no, that's a whole process. I mean, you have good skin. You fine. Yeah. You fine. My skin is alright. Yeah. They used to say, <laughs> I wash my 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 face with the the leftover dishwasher water. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> do you do you? Use makeup. I do. Uh, but not excessively. Or is what's excessively? Like, As you, that's, that's a question for you. <laughs> um, but like it depends on where I'm going or whatever. What but the like, occasion is. Yeah. I like to keep it light. light. I don't go like hectic weird. Why do you wear makeup? Um, I like it. It's fun. Why should anyone or why does anyone wear makeup? I think it just... It makes you it, look more pretty. You know, it enhances what you have. Yeah, yeah. like an yes. even skin tone. It like makes your eyes look bigger. But what's wrong with you naturally? Yes. Nothing. So then why... It's like, yeah, I'm okay, cool. I'm like fine the way I am. But it's sure. like, it's fun. It's the same way you wear like your nice watch or your nice sneakers when you go out. You yeah. know what I mean? It's like, just to feel a bit nicer. Mm. Yeah. yeah, you know? That's all it is. But then you can see my my watch yeah. and my sneakers. <laughs> you can you it's not you can tell. Okay, this guy he doesn't. It's not part of his skin. But with <laughs> women, like it's almost deceptive in some I was cases. It's say. almost like why do guys go every two weeks for a haircut or like go to we the barber? It's good. a haircut. Ex- no. But exactly, you're doing yeah. it to look good. You look fine without cutting your hair every ah, two ah, weeks. Ah, no, no, that's no. Cap- <laughs> I mean, I if you cut my hair, like I, I only cut a little bit on the sides, but if I don't cut my hair, people like once every two, two weeks, yeah, like, <laughs> every two <laughs> weeks, exactly. like I'm sure, like once a month would be fine. No, no. really, never. Is this a, like an extra thing? Every, every week, every week. Yeah, some people cut every three days. My God, but I always, I always feel cut. like, like if you just like clean up the edges, you know, yeah, it's like. Doesn't matter oh, what else is going on. Yeah. Oh, it looks yeah. weird. A blanket really? that's thrown. No. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Let's be like. But I do. I, I won't lie. Sometimes, especially during winter, yeah. I don't cut my hair for So like, it has to be like months. the fade. And, and, then the... When, and then when I do cut it, I'm like, damn. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that? Such a cat yeah. right now, you know? <laughs> so I do. I do get it. It does enhance. It does, yeah. yeah. But I get what you're saying. It can be deceptive. Can you know what I mean? Because like some women can transform. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's like it's so different to when. It scares me. I'm not gonna. But lie. It's all. The, it's all. It's all. The, <laughs> I'm telling you. Clowns, <laughs> like ha- Halloween. Yeah. I don't care about ghosts and stuff. I look out for girls. With <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I scared of clowns. No, no, no. Are you scared of clowns? No. Who's scared of clowns? I'm not scared of clown, no. but it does get like it's just for me. It's a, it's and there's a lot of women like who date, and the guy they're with, they hardly ever take off their makeup, or they wake up in the morning okay. and they oh, do they, their stuff. They their yeah, so just, he doesn't see, he doesn't see the natural, and that freaks me out. That's why so much of there? effort. Yeah. Like why why are we there? Why do we feel we have to always look 
amazing. But do you not feel like men also put pressure on women? Yeah. You know what I mean? It's, I'm saying, that's what I'm saying. Yeah. Why are we there? Why yeah, are yeah, we yeah, all yeah. In, the, in the space? No, but I yeah. don't think it has anything to do with men. Like, I, I think it does. No, A lot I of it stems from that, that need to impress the opposite no, I don't discriminate. Even if you have eczema, you're good enough for me. You know? I'm eczema. Bio, extra <laughs> 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 But it, it, it really boils down to it. It's not a big deal, yeah. you know? Yeah. Because if you choose someone, essentially you want them for who they are. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you know? not what skin. It, it, not what you see. Okay, obviously, the very, like, when you want someone, you are. Yeah, you're the like, touch. Oh, yes. She's beautiful. Yeah. 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 She does it for you. Yeah. But... You don't have to, okay, for me, I'm saying girls, you don't have to make up. Yeah, like, yeah. me too. Texas are a rare breed. Me too. I'm, I'm not yeah. a rare breed. There's many guys like us. I haven't encountered yeah. many. Yeah, no, I don't want any. It's, it's, it's hard waking up next to a different person. But, <laughs> but I hard. think also what you were saying about how when you meet someone, you're like, oh, she's beautiful. Yeah. And then like the girl feels like, oh, I need to maintain. Yeah, the you way need to maintain that image. Me, you know yeah. what I mean? have to maintain i saw you once before <laughs> yeah. i don't know <laughs> you know what what I'm can come you have this. nice toes so it's fine <laughs> yeah. how old are you Lisa? how old are you i'm 31 oh. there's no ways mm. yeah. how, how old do I, I i love asking people tell me i look like younger tell yeah me. you do you look like <laughs> 20s like early, early like 20s. to 25 i'd cap yeah, it at 25 makeup. yeah I and the vaseline yeah. <laughs> <laughs> has to be the vaseline <laughs> And then where do you see like this whole skincare stuff going? Um, I'd love to come out with a brand of my own. Dope. Yeah. Yeah. So that's like a goal. Must use us to market me and takes. Yeah. For sure. Even if it's for women. Yeah. <laughs> Not even the girl that's <laughs> sitting here. No, no, just no. them just too. Them, just the guys. Yeah. Okay, cool. Everywhere we go, like just like talk about anything. Yeah, I know the guy got shot three times, but using this. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. We are always ready. Yeah. Try Lisa's potion. Yeah. Lisa's lotion. <laughs> it also works as laxative. <laughs> Just take two teaspoons in the morning. You're good. Yeah. Worse from the inside. <laughs> Yo, guys. Already, boom. You're selling your product. <laughs> no, yeah. I'll remember you. I'll remember you guys. You with are. time. <laughs> you beauty. Well, like, I feel like, does it have like a time span? You know, like most things people are into, most careers, anything yeah. that only lasts a certain period of time. So is like there like sports, a certain age you need to be to get into beauty? No, I don't think it's a, a certain age. But I think it's wise to kind of pivot you know what i mean to like be like okay cool this is what i'm doing now but it's not going to be forever yeah so like how do i build on this mm-hmm. and to create something lasting sure. okay it's like mm-hmm. a sustainable business mm-hmm. so yeah there's mm-hmm. right, people like doing beauty 17 and it's like some young people i feel like that's a catfish Why? if you're like 17 and doing skincare and beauty and all of that because your be... skin is still young you know you don't yes. you haven't faced the the many things that can happen between like your early 20s, I think. Because mm. you hit 18, your face starts maturing. You have to wear sunblock all the time. Okay. Yeah. No, you have like mm. all the time. You start getting like creases in your skin. That's just aging. Yeah, but that's that's what I'm saying. Mm. So like if you're 17 years old and you don't have wrinkles or you don't have like blemishes or your acne isn't that bad, mm. then... How can you be at like advocating for skincare because your skin is naturally already so mm. pure? Do you know what I'm saying? Okay, fair. Yeah. That's a fair point. I've seen I've seen the other day I saw on, on social media like this <laughs> thing they do, some acid thing, and then your skin peels. An acid peel. Okay. Yeah, and then yeah. you look so much younger. Yeah. 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 Would you Would you recommend that or like have you seen it first of all? I've done it. You've done it? Yes. Yo. How long like, does it take for like the peeling to finish? Because I want to do it, but I don't want to walk around. It depends like, which one you do. <laughs> yeah. Yo, my skin is falling off. Yeah. Trying to go to it dinner. It depends which one you do. So okay. like, 
you know how we you scrub you used to scrub your face back in the day. I don't know if you guys still do it, like with, with, with the like, orange pee, with, orange with the, pack. The, <laughs> 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 Listen, hey, I love that thing, eh? Like, yeah. like, <laughs> but you know how like sugar scrubs and, and coffee mm. scrubs, all of that. We don't use it on our face anymore. Yeah, we don't do that. There's like we call them liquid exfoliants. Mm -hmm. So it's like a liquid mm -hmm. that ex like kind of exfoliates your skin, and then you start peeling. Mm -hmm. You can buy at home products mm -hmm. and you'll like use it and start seeing a difference. Is it or, not dangerous? No, it's actually safer for your skin. How much of your skin comes off? Just like well, the if you're first going layer. In, if you're going into like an aesthetic clinic, mm. they're doing like a stronger one and then you might see some flaking and stuff. Is that with but the laser can, stuff? Or well, is that something, do something else? Something else. Maybe yeah. something else. <laughs> <laughs> How many things are there? Bruh, you can, uh, this, you this future you can is confusing. You can literally get a new face. Like, your face can go back yeah. to 16 years old. Bro, yeah. wow, why? Yeah. I don't know. It's <laughs> fun. You know, before I turned 30, a friend yeah. of mine was like, listen, girl, you're going to start seeing things. Like, yeah. your, your skin's just going to change. I was like... Whatever. But I swear, I don't know, there's something that happens when you reach 30. <laughs> a good thing or a bad thing? It doesn't matter what you do, yeah. it's going to happen to your face again. Yeah. yeah. You, it's not, you're not going to stop the process. Because it's natural. You Aging gotta get is old. natural. Yeah, it you is. But you still like, you know, want to like look after do you. you <laughs> do, do you complement your skin and beauty lifestyle? With like exercise and stuff. 100%. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. And how often do you exercise and do the things? Um, Five times a week. God oh, that's basically every day. Yeah. <laughs> nine to five. I yeah. haven't been to gym in like a month, guys. No, I'm no. not. I've been and you're sleeping? No, I love my sleep. Okay. Yeah. I feel I like rather, girls in general rather, love sleep No, listen, more. I'd rather be hungry than tired. <laughs> <laughs> That's but how I feel like girls love sleep more in general. They do. God, yeah, God, they God do. is just giving them... No, listen. They love sleep. Like, like like a don't extra, don't yeah. interrupt my sleep. I've broken <laughs> up with someone because they sleep too much. You laugh. I've broken <laughs> up with someone because they sleep too much. I, I'm not even joking. Like, every time they sit down, they want to sleep. Like... Like, when are we going to chill? Like, stop <laughs> sleeping. You come let's nap. No, I'm not tired, bro. And I don't want to nap alone. As if I'm going to be naughty when I'm awake alone. Yeah. Let's go nap. I'm like, I never slept this much. In my life. <laughs> Thanks. That was no. special. Yeah. That's rough. Okay, so you do. You have a, a decent balance in in terms of. Because it does help Yeah, skin, no, right? it does. It really or does. Like the overall beauty and stuff. Because yeah. a lot of the times, like your skin is a reflection of your lifestyle. Mm. So if you're eating unhealthy, drinking, partying too much, not getting enough sleep, you'll see it on your face. And once you change that, sometimes it's not about... No, I've seen beautiful it's not about people who don't sleep, <laughs> but you eat nonsense. How much makeup are they wearing? And the drugs. No. <laughs> <laughs> drugs. <laughs> no makeup. I've seen beautiful people who don't take care of themselves. So I guess sometimes maybe it's just genetics. Yeah, or, it's luck of the draw, bro. Yeah. Mm. Just get what you get. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I wouldn't take... Like, I do jump, jump. The jump lifestyle for me was more about changing my life. Mm. But there's not much I would do to 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 change my appearance. Like... You love yourself. I do. I, that's I amazing. Do Dex, yeah. weren't you the one that said that if... A plastic surgeon approach you, you would change your entire body. <laughs> yes, like it's my Allah. Just because he's offering, he's like, let's do this. I'm like, yeah. Why would you change? Put some calves in there. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I would change everything. It That's his biggest insecurity about calves. <laughs> <laughs> Not really, like, yeah. but I'm just like, if it's free, I'll do it. You do it. Yeah. I hear you. I, so I get why you're into beauty because you're getting these products for free. How much did you spend? On beauty products before you did what you do? A lot. Of money, yeah. yes. Your money or your parents' money? I know my money. Okay. Isn't that my the catch, though, of, of um, this whole beauty industry? Excuse mm. me. Is that essentially just asking us to, to pay a lot of money to look a certain way, use all the products and stuff? Yeah, pretty much. Ah, uh, you know... I think the way I see it, the way what I'm doing is I'm helping you 
make better choices. So I'm actually saying, okay, this is more affordable and this is going to do the job. So instead of trying five other things and spending thousands, he has a product for like 300 Rand that's going to do it for you. So, so it's you, like yeah, taking the, uh, the intimidation out of... That whole thing. So you're saying... If I'm understanding correctly, okay. you understand that how it works and you're coming in as sort of a, not a middleman, but like someone to help out, you know, the us on the ground here, <laughs> trying to figure it out and make it not so intimidating. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Fair enough. Would you do what you do for free? Like, would you recommend products without expecting any sort of payment? If I was getting money like some other way, but mm. if I yeah, if you had a day job, yeah, if you were in the call center, <laughs> 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 when the reception is. <laughs> <laughs> As a kid, what did you dream of being, Lisa? Yo, guys, I wanted to be a police officer. Damn, it's like going back in the day, you know. Yeah. Yeah, I wanted to be a police officer and wanted to be a... You gave like, up on that dream. I gave up on that dream very quick. Why? Damn. No, and I was just you like... like cold drink. Yeah, I don't like... <laughs> 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 don't like cold drink. <laughs> yeah, no. So I gave up on that. Did you want to be like a detective or what? A beat cop. <laughs> this, is like, this is like primary school, guys. Like, I just like dogs. And I was like, yo, I want to be cool like that in a uniform with like a dog. Yeah. Yeah. So, being like a police <laughs> dog. Yeah. 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 Was like, How do you feel about the police dog? And what Does South Africa dog? have yeah. police dogs? Yes. Oh, We've got the police dog. Oh. I've South never Africa. seen a police dog in South Africa. What? what? Never. Maybe, okay, she's you know when you <laughs> spend all your time in the suburbs, you're not exposed yeah, to the law. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you don't see the food yeah. of the law. Yes, yes, yes. No one is, will sniff a nika for drugs. They're yeah. like, oh, don't send the dog. You know, that's like he's hiding something. Yeah. We've seen them. What okay. dogs are they? Alsatians. Yeah. Alsatians, yeah. Wow. The police dog. The police dogs. So, like, where do you see them? Do you just see them driving in the back of the van, or do they come like? They call them for me. Yeah, I look like I have shit on me right now. (laughs) (laughs) You always call them for me. The one day they put me, they put me in the back of the van, where where the dogs were, and the dog was like barking in my face. They were just they let me go. Mm. They were just trying to scare me into giving them more cold drink, but yeah, I did not have cold drink on me at Mm. the time. Yeah. Wow. So, so li- moral of the story is as long as you have cold drink, yeah. you'll be You're fine. safe in this country. No, you listen. never go to jail. Hmm? Yeah. I didn't have cold drink. When? And I, when I got pulled off, pulled over the last time. And, and I was like, <laughs> did they give you a but, I, but I had my sister in the car and my mom at the back. So I was like, oh my gosh. Hi. Yeah, meet my mom. Meet my sister. <laughs> <laughs> You're selling a family. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, you know what? This is my first time being pulled over. I yeah. use that excuse too. Oh my god! Like, and then you make yourself like all excited, like, oh my god, this is a new experience. <laughs> I've been waiting. <laughs> By that point, they don't even want to ask you they for a bribe, for cool juice. Do. They don't want to give you a ticket either. Oh, oh guys, I swear rough. it works. Or if they, they like take you out of the car to show you your license disc is expired, you must just say, oh, I didn't know. You know, I don't check these things. My dad is supposed to check them for me. It works. No cool drink. It, yeah. was, like, it was a point where he was like, ah, so what are we going to do now? I was like, yeah, hey, yeah, my mom just came from the airport. So like, <laughs> and then he just let us go. Yeah. Yo, I, it's not that easy for us. No. Yeah. No, I, yeah. I it's think it's amazing. because you guys are eager to to get a way out of, like, find a solution to no, the situation. I don't want a no. Like, I've noticed guys are, like, very, like, you know, if they need to bribe, they're, like, more than willing to bribe. No. Or more than no, willing no to sweet to talk. That. No one likes to bribe. It's a... It's a dirty thing. Yeah. I don't think yeah. I don't think you like to, but I think if it's a way out of getting a ticket, you guys are more than more than willing to no, go through I, that I, process. I, I, don't, I don't pay no bribes. As a female, I'm not I'm not giving cool drink. I'm not giving bribes, mm. and I'm not getting a ticket either. One way or another, I'm finding 
You want to use your charm. I'm going to be there. Oh my god. <laughs> That's evil. Thank you for this <laughs> experience. Can I get a selfie? <laughs> yeah. You hit them up with the I'm so glad you pulled me over. You're so nice. I was so worried. Yeah, and they fall for this. Yeah, every But time. I'm going to become a cop just to every stop. Every time. Them. Yeah. I'm going to arrest you hard. Look at your chat sheet is like you guys. Yeah. Well like this man don't like me. Yeah. yeah I just, I just arrest women, yeah. pretty women. For no reason. You're trying to bribe me with smiles. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's yeah. rough. No, I don't pay no bribes. Like, I don't believe in paying bribes. Mm-hmm. And if I'm wrong, like I will suffer the... But cops can be lastach also. Yeah. You know, even yeah. if you're not doing something wrong, they yeah. find a way to kind of get you just into that situation. Ah, but I've been, I've had enough co- encounters with the law I understand the dance now. Mm-hmm. I know what offense you it's just an overnight uh, you know like, ah, mm-hmm. I know. I spent a few nights there. How was it? Uh, Yo, it's terrible. <laughs> Being in a holding cell is terrible. Is it clean? No way. It's not your mother's house. <laughs> Did anyone like like talk to you or interfere with you? Just like Sometimes you make friends in in the prison cell. <laughs> like there's some guy at the gym. I I still get him and we because we got arrested together for for uh Drunk and driving. Sometimes it's a dope experience. Sometimes it's not. Like, yeah. Do they sometimes give you, you food? Friends, like, they start. You all get stopped in the same operation. You're like, ah, oh, bro, <laughs> why are you here? <laughs> yeah, I don't want to phone anyone. Please just pay my bail also. I sold you out. Like, does the police station give you food in the morning? Yeah. yeah What did you do? get to eat? Brown bread and tea. <laughs> Weak tea. <laughs> <laughs> Weak. Was there like stuff on the bread, like butter? No, like to jam. be honest, I've never eaten the food. Like I've never oh. eaten it, and most of the time I'm out before they actually serve food. That's so thoughtful. It's not thoughtful. Just thoughtful. brown bread like and wheat tea. They have to. You are human being. They like, have you to. You are in their care. Yeah. It's Whatever like, happens oh. to you, they are responsible for it. So they have to feed you. It's not that because they are nice. <laughs> But it's like bare minimum looking after you. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Just so you live. You have yeah. a pulse That's to keep you alive, terrible. so you can suffer in this. What if you like allergic to gluten? Like what oh, if I got what if I got arrested? Uh, I'm gluten neither. intolerant. I can't eat bread. Listen, you think they were a kid? Their primary responsibility is to give you the food, whether you eat it or not. It's your business. Yo. Like, <laughs> gluten, Imagine gluten, I eat gluten, it gluten, and then yeah. I'm just like. I remember, like a few years back, my mom got arrested. Right. There. Uh, uh, <laughs> and. <laughs> What? In her life. And I knew this dance. The cops came looking for her and I'm like, don't come home. <laughs> you are going to jail. Yeah. And then she insisted on going. I'm like, okay, go. And she went. And they locked her up and she's like, phone this lawyer, phone this lawyer. I'm like, bruh. There's no lawyer that's going to get you out. <laughs> you are going to sleep there. Oh my God. And like when she was there, she had a panic attack. And I'm like, can you imagine? Like at the age of 60, this is extra Shame. traumatic, you know? Oh, no. Uh, <laughs> and the whole experience, I was just guiding it through. I'm like, be strong. Oh, It's okay, you're going to sleep. <laughs> They'll let you out for court. Because I told her, find someone to sleep, just report to court. How it works? And she's like, how do you know so much about this stuff? <laughs> <laughs> like, no, I'm only a professional. <laughs> What did she get arrested for? A uh, little, a little scuffle. Oh, okay. It was so. Well, it was a little scuffle, and a case was made, and you know, man, so they don't care if it was a big fight or a scuffle. Mm. If I say a nigga hit me, mm. they are coming to arrest me. Really? Wow. Yeah. You can't hit anyone in this country. Your body is protected. All of us, our body is protected. What if, what if you hit me first, and then I hit you, you in self-defense? But then you make the case first, because you go make a case first. Yeah. They're gonna fix. So yeah. how do I so prove that you hit me? Story. That's what the court is for. <laughs> so like, basically, so he know said, she if said, you really hit me, but you're going to jail. Look, they're not unreasonable. The law is very. <laughs> I sound like a criminal. <laughs> 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 they're not unreasonable the law like they will sit with you guys sometimes before the case goes to court okay because they don't want to waste the court's time so if it's just like you two are fighting they're like guys grow up <laughs> if you made a case 
and you make a case also. Mm. Both of you can go to jail for the same thing. So mm. they will talk to you guys, and you 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 even like you can withdraw the case and they'll let you both go. Oh. Yeah, that's usually like if I, especially with, with with domestic violence. Yeah. So the wife will make a case, the husband makes a case, and then it's like guys, you guys live together. Come on, you'll need to work whatever. Like, Mm. please work it, yeah, work it out yeah work it out behave but obviously a record is kept so if it keeps happening they're gonna be like something yeah something is up okay here. Yeah. wow good and to know good to know crime. yeah crime talk <laughs> 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 Louis Matei <laughs> <laughs> Lisa anything you wanna add before we say goodbye um I think this was awesome you yeah. guys are awesome and uh stick with your Vaseline <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for coming. Lisa. No, this is cool, guys. Thanks yeah, for having me. Some beauty tips. What what one product can you recommend for me right now? SPF. SPF. Yes, please. Okay. Is that sunblock? Black does crack. Black that does sunblock. Crack. <laughs> I was told you just supposed to just be using sunblock. I didn't know. Not lotion. No, I'm saying like. I thought only when you go out, maybe if it uh, go for a picnic or to the beach. No, but apparently it's all supposed the time. to just it's have all to the time. use it. All the time. I had no idea. I learned you know like what I want to know? Since when is like this SPF thing a thing? What is SPF? Because like it's it's sunblock. Okay. But what I mean, back in the caveman days, they weren't wearing sunblock. Yeah. So were those homies also just dying of cancer all the time? <laughs> <laughs> that's a good question. I that, I thought. Because the cancer cancer research has only been going on for like X amount of time. But okay. if they were if they were dying from yeah, cancer, yeah. like skin cancer. But they lived a lot longer than us. I think these products are making us soft. Did they live a lot? <laughs> Weren't they only living to like 19, 12, <laughs> that kind of no, story? 12. Because no. people <laughs> were dying from <laughs> yeah. diseases what have you at done? a young No, age. like they, huh? come on. <laughs> People in the Victorian era, which was just now, now were dying at That's the age Victorian. of at fifteen. That's Victorian. Can you imagine a caveman? And stuff then we're talking caveman time. Cavemen also had diseases. Malaria was too. still no, a thing. Those guys used to push a hundred, hundred and twenty. Easy. Yeah, we ah, easy. 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 If I you a, broke a, a foot friend. as a caveman, that was if it. You if if you broke a foot as a caveman, that yeah. was it. No, your no, your no, your no, people no, would yeah. leave you. <laughs> you, eat, eat, you oh. eat that food. <laughs> you eat your <laughs> <laughs> sustenance. <laughs> <laughs> okay, oh. we have to wrap up. Thank cool, you for cool. coming. Okay. Thank you for having me. And then. Thank you for coming as well, Anita. Oh, thanks Thank for having for me, guys. Yeah. On myself, Lisa, and Takes' his podcast. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Every episode. You know what? It's fine. One day I'm just not going to come. Because, do you know, class. yeah. Then I'll have you guys stressing for real. We will come do the podcast at your house. In the kitchen. Yo, that's like. We should actually do something like that. Get everyone to come to my kitchen. Should have like a cooking yeah. session. You I know? make cook sisters. Oh, yeah. can you? I made bolas like two weeks ago. Okay, but Not can even two you? Weeks. Oh, they were so good. Okay, but can you? Yes, I can. <laughs> it's a promise on camera. I never promised. I just said I could do it. We've got it on record. Yeah. <laughs> don't lie. No going back now. Don't lie. Don't come to you. Don't come to myself, Dates and Lisa's podcast, <laughs> <laughs> and promise cook sisters <laughs> and don't deliver. <laughs> I'll bring the weak tea. It'll remind Shop. you of yeah. the good old the good old yeah. days. I've never tasted. I've only seen. <laughs> <laughs> I'll get I'll get my mom to shout us like a warden. You know, like she'll shout us. So holding cells. It'll be police the, officer. Yeah. No oh, warden. Sorry, my bad. A police officer. No. Thank you and a dog. You have dogs. I have a dog, yeah. Dog can bark at us yeah. for fun. I... <laughs> <laughs> for ambience. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thank you. Lisa. Thank you. Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. <laughs>